Jace Lejeune from Gridiron Football. We are here at Pineville for our second annual Gridiron Football Media Day. But the first one we held up here in Pineville. And of course, we can't uh, escape here without talking to the Ash Trojans. I'm, of course, one of the top programs in the state of Louisiana. And we got a big group. So we actually uh, <laughs> divided with two different interviews that we're going to do. Um, but first, we're going to talk to, we're going to start off with somebody that's been pretty familiar with us, went to our Gridiron Football League camps, and it's Jimmy Duncan. Uh, Jimmy, uh, thanks for showing up, man and uh, talk about this upcoming season. What are you looking forward to the most? Uh, I'm really looking forward to really just winning the state championship, really. That's our goal. Yeah, I mean, that's always the goal, right? Uh, and I, I know you all really made some, a lot of deep runs in the playoffs um, under Coach Botman. And now we got this big guy up uh, with me who may actually end up being my bodyguard at some, at some point in time. Uh, but uh, introduce yourself to the Green Iron football fan base. Uh, my name is Jacoby Morris. Uh, I play left guard, Ash. All right, Jacoby. So Jacoby Morris. Uh, so you're a big guy up front. Uh, you like to clear the path, right? Um, so do you like run blocking more? Or you like uh, pass protection? I like run blocking more because you get more pancakes. Oh, you like those pancakes? Huh? You like to serve them up? Yes, sir. <laughs> I like that. I like that a lot. Uh, we're going back to Jimmy. Uh, I know you play. Uh, you play defense, and are you playing a little bit of offense too. No, uh, I'm mostly offense this year. Oh, mostly offense. Okay. If I had to play defense, I would. Okay, um, so what are like the biggest strengths to your game? Uh, the biggest strength of my game is really my way to get open in the field. Uh, I really rarely drop a pass, so I'm... Yeah. Uh, I can't get the word out, but no, you're good. you know what I'm trying to say. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. And then uh, for you as well, um, I know you talked about you like run blocking, but what are the biggest strengths to your game? Um, I feel like I got a good punch, a good footwork, and I feel like can't nobody beat me in a run blocking game. Yeah, I don't want to mess with you either. <laughs> that's for that's for certain. Uh, but obviously, there's always something for y'all to improve on and get better. So, what is that thing that you're looking on to get better? Uh, really, my speed. Uh, I just, that's really mostly I need to get like work on. So that's what I've been working on this off season, and I got better at it, working on my technique and running. So this year gonna be a great year. Before I go back to Jacoby, I know you've really worked on that because you actually went to uh, East Ascension uh, this year and participated in our elite camp. So talk about that event so they got really a chance to catch up with you on that event and how did it help you get better? Uh, it was a nice event to go to. Like if you like if you know you ain't get <clears throat> if you know you ain't getting no rest like in a big camp, you go to like a little small camp around and just work on your craft and just get better day by day. I gotcha, I gotcha. And then uh, for you as well, what, what is the thing that you're trying to get better at? Um, mainly my pass blocking. Uh, I feel like it's already good, but it can get really better. Uh, so can't nobody pass me around, pass me on the pass blocking. I'm stopping them, and they can't get to the quarterback. Well, uh, it makes your job a little bit easier when you got a back behind you, like like, like JT, right? Uh, so what is it like blocking for a guy like that? And sometimes you have the best uh, seat in the house to see some of his runs, right? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, it's a good feeling, really. It just makes your job a lot better. Uh, every time you get a good block, you see him run to the touchdown. It just makes you want to celebrate. Yeah, and uh, what's it like coach, uh, really playing for Coach Botman? I mean, uh, tell me a little bit about Coach Botman. I know he's done a great job with this program. What kind of coach is he Is he like? Uh, he's a great coach. He, he'll he be hard on you. He'll be tough on you, but he still cares about you and everything. He's going to make sure you're straight. Like, he, you can talk to him about anything. Like, you can have a sit down, anything, but he's still going to coach you like everybody else. He ain't going to treat nobody different. I like that. I like that. What do you like most about Coach Botman? Uh, he's a very high-demanding coach. Uh, he will get on you because he he wants your very best. He knows that you can give his give your very best. Um, he's a, he's a loving coach, and we have great moments. Okay, uh, give a shout out to uh, really the Ash uh, Trojan fan base and what they should be expecting from y'all guys this year. Uh, they should just expect like a winning season. Like they should pack out every game. They should be at every game really to show support. Yep, and well. Last minute message to, to the fan base? Uh, you spent nothing but a bunch of W's, man. Um, just just dominate, just straight dominance. Well, I appreciate y'all guys. Uh, two of the top seniors on the squad uh, for the Ash Trojans, who I'm sure we'll, our, our staff's going to write more about y'all when we have our Diamond the Rough interviews with y'all guys for the upcoming season. But we'll have a big season preview on the Ash Trojans. To check that out, make sure to go to our website. That is gridironfootballusa.com.